Welcome everyone to this lecture on Threat and Error Management in Air Traffic Control. Today, we will discuss how threat and error management helps improve safety and efficiency in ATC operations. TEM is a safety framework designed to manage the inevitable threats and errors that occur in aviation. Its goal is to enhance safety and operational efficiency by providing controllers with intuitive tools to deal with complex situations. Developed by the University of Texas Human Factors Research Project, TEM is widely applied in air traffic control and other aviation services. The framework allows controllers to handle challenges proactively, ensuring safety margins are maintained throughout operations. The key idea is that threats and errors are a part of every ATC environment, and by recognizing and managing them early, we can prevent unsafe situations. Threat and Error Management Framework consists of three primary components. Threats are events that occur outside the controller's control but increase complexity, such as unexpected weather changes or pilot errors. Errors refer to actions or inactions by air traffic controllers that deviate from standard procedures or expectations. These could be mistakes in communication or misunderstanding procedural requirements. Undesired states are situations where the safety margin is reduced, such as an aircraft being at the wrong altitude or on the wrong heading. Managing these three components is key to maintaining safety, and controllers need to continuously monitor the airspace, detect issues early, and apply countermeasures to prevent escalation. In ATC, threats come from various sources. Internal threats are issues within the control environment, like equipment malfunctions or procedural difficulties. External threats are factors outside the controller's immediate influence, such as complex airspace design, challenges coordinating with other sectors, pilot errors, or unusual aircraft performance. Environmental threats, like bad weather or airspace reservation, terrain, obstacles, add further complexity to an already demanding job. The key here is that while threats cannot be eliminated, being aware of them allows controllers to manage their impact and prevent them from escalating into dangerous situations. Errors are inevitable in any human-centered operation, including ATC. Some common types of errors include equipment handling errors, misuse or misunderstanding of automation systems or radar can lead to incorrect decision-making, procedural errors, Mistakes in following or applying ATC procedures, such as incorrect handovers or not providing critical information, can jeopardize safety, communication errors, misunderstanding instructions between controllers or between controllers and pilots is a major contributor to incidents, error management in TEM focuses on early detection and quick resolution. By identifying an error before it leads to an unsafe condition, controllers can prevent accidents from occurring. The management of threats and errors in ATC requires a combination of proactive and reactive strategies. Proactive management means anticipating threats before they become problematic. This is achieved through strong teamwork, clear communication, and efficient planning. To effectively manage threats and errors in ATC, it's crucial that controllers constantly update themselves with standard operating procedures. SOPs are foundational guidelines that dictate how ATC tasks should be carried out to ensure safety, efficiency, and consistency. Teamwork and leadership play a huge role in effective management. Controllers must communicate effectively with each other and with pilots, and leadership helps in decision-making under pressure. Continuous monitoring is essential. Controllers must constantly observe evolving operational conditions, adjusting their strategies as new threats or errors arise. Effective management involves real-time adjustments to restore safety margins if something goes wrong. An undesired state is when safety margins are reduced due to a threat or error. In these situations, the controller must act quickly to restore safety. Some examples include an aircraft flying at the wrong altitude or heading. A delayed handover between controllers causing a runway incursion, incorrect separation between two aircraft due to a miscommunication, when an undesired state occurs, the focus shifts to immediate recovery. The controller must quickly intervene to correct the issue and return operations to a safe state. This often involves reissuing instructions, rerouting aircraft, or coordinating with other controllers to avoid a potential collision or other incident. 
Threat and Error Management TM, enhances ATC safety by focusing on managing threats, errors, and undesired states in real time. This framework ensures that controllers are equipped to handle the challenges that arise during daily operations and can make fast, effective decisions to maintain safety margins. The future of TEM lies in expanding its principles through ongoing training, adopting new technology, and refining safety management systems. Continuous improvement is vital in the ever-evolving world of air traffic control.